Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. You need to relax, Michael. No, Michael. Much better, Michael. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It is bright and early. For people who are driving to work, how are you? And this is your radio romance. So radio romance. Video killed a radio star. Okay, social media killed. <laughs> The TV star. Okay. Welcome to my channel. We're doing your live re re reading. So this is recorded live and we re-upload it. Okay. So for people can watch it again. Okay. So if you are new to this channel, I do say Dear Astrology together with Tarot because timeless is useless. However, I have moved the sidereal in the extended. So that's where I do my timing and prediction. That's where I see what is about to happen mm -hmm. even further so it's get those those are going to be in the description box later on okay so do check that out and also get your chart if you don't know your chart it is going to be in the description box also all right so without further ado let's begin roll camera two is right there <laughs> okay so let's see what's going on okay <sighs> okay here we go here we go. Here we go. How are my Taurus? Okay. Be my lady. Ace of Swords, be my lady. Come to me and Ace of Swords, who are we talking to? Who are we cutting? Rahu in Critica Nakshatra. Tring, 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 tring. You know, it's like a psycho in that movie. Like that, yeah. Because Rahu is not the killer, but it is Critica Nakshatra that is cutting. Critica Nakshatra, I believe, is sun-ruled Nakshatra. Yes, it is. So we've seen the light of the relationship and it's time for you to execute the Ace of Swords. A cutting communication. You know, when a Taurus becomes straight and blunt, well, you really did it. You really did it, did you anyway? No. <laughs> so, um, and then K2 on the opposite end, you know, in Scorpio. So, is it a time for us to be in a relationship? That's the question. Well, it's time for us to resolve a relationship because Ace of Swords is communication through, okay, like it can be lead to vic victorious kind of relationship, but only if truth is there. Mm-hmm. So you're going to go and talk to someone. This is not like a new person. I don't think so. This is a person that you will just discuss the T's. Mm -hmm. The details. Not the birds and the bees. Okay, that's different. Oh, here it is. You're going to ask this person, why have you been using me and abusing me? There's the Ten of Pentacles. You've been serving and not slaying. Okay, so you have been serving this person tremendously. You are a devotee. We call this devoto. Okay. So you are a number one follower, the number one subscriber of this person in their life. Okay. You give you probably shared finances, because Ten of Pentacles, you shared your home, you open your doors over here. Let me take care of you. But I just want you to be honest with me. This is what you're saying now. Ace of Swords with the Ten of Pentacles. Can you be honest with me? Are you just using me? Are you just here because you want something from me, Ten of Pentacles? And of course, the truth is you want to discuss what's the next move? Because this, this is a chess piece right here. What's our next plan over here? Because mm -hmm. you can feel right now that this person is just taking advantage of you. Mm. Four of Pentacles, because they are not as, uh, you know, like giving as like what you would have hoped for. So they're a taker. And then you got yourself a taker, which means like you're a giver. Because a taker and a taker, they never get together. A giver and a giver, they never get together, okay? <laughs> Normally, you know, it's a give and take. That's what they say in relationship. But there's a give and take. But this one is take, take, take. Okay? We had that fiasco in my country, take it. 
Take it. Take it. Okay. It was in the Manila Film Festival. Okay. Gabby Conception. <laughs> so anyhow, okay. So this is a person who just takes it. Takes it and takes it. Four of Pentacles. Very greedy. They don't spend time with you. I mean, when they want to, they would make themselves available because they want something from you. And then right away, once they got, got it, it's like they're gone. They're gone. Mm. Four of Pentacles. Mm. Justice card. Oh, okay. I sense a little bit of hate coming from them. I'm not adding file to the fury. Is that so? <laughs> file to the file. File to the injury. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> this is live. Okay. And I can't speak correctly. <laughs> okay. Mercury is in retrograde by January, so I'm feeling it now. Okay. January 14, 2022. Okay. <laughs> so <laughs> I have a relapse. Okay. A file to the injury. Fire to the soul, fire to the oil, something like that, okay? Whatever. You, you catch my drift, Taurus, right? So with the Justice card here, um, I feel like they're very vindictive. They feel that they're saying here that, well, this is what you deserve. I don't know why. Okay. This person is not good for you, okay? Because they feel like you deserve this. Like, they're not nice. They're mean. Okay. I don't like that, okay? Like, nobody deserves to be, like, that okay when you're doing everything and yet they would take advantage and then they feel entitled what's wrong with this person mm. what's wrong with your chart no <laughs> because remember our chart shows who we're gonna date mm -hmm. mm. let's begin here hello to the people in the room six of wands oh okay so the person even claims that well i can change i can replace you if you're just gonna cut me off okay Fine, six of ones. I got people. I got people. Mm -hmm. I got people wanting to text me, call me. Six of ones right here. So the person is arrogant. The person feels like they are on the top of the food chain. Six of ones. The person feels that you very much entitled, darling. Very, very entitled. Okay. Yeah, I saw. Fuel to the fire. Okay. Yeah, I saw also in the comments. Thank you very much. Fuel to the fire. Okay. But I like file. Okay, because file and fuel is the same. Okay, so file. Okay. <laughs> You're adding file to my workload. <laughs> Six of Wands with Ace of Swords. Um, you talk to them directly with, uh, with the Six of Wands. And then this person even ignores you. Look at that. Okay. They got naysayers. They're friends. It's just, uh, I don't understand why this their friends is even siding on them on this one. But, you know, birds with the same feather... Our chances are just birds. Okay. <laughs> you know that saying, okay? Birds with the same feather. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Seven of swords. I, liar. I told you. Look at that. I didn't know that these two cards. Look, okay, Taurus. Chess piece and chess piece. Okay. So this person has been playing a game. Okay. It's either Game of Thrones, Hunger Games, or Game and Watch. <laughs> you know Game and Watch? Okay. It's like uh, like this. Okay. Google Game and Watch. Okay. So they've been playing game mm -hmm. the whole time. Mm. Look, they're already trying to figure out what's your next move, what you're going to say, how you're going to say it, and then they're going to make the move right there. And you're asking also them, it's like, listen, what's your next move? Because I see through your lies and you can't, you know, like you can't keep doing this. Because this person has been stringing you along like a string cheese. Mm -hmm. Now look at this here. Underneath that table, there's a lot of mechanics under the table. Which only means that this person already has figured out different ways of manipulating the situation and turning it around against you. This person is not good. Okay, high priestess. And look at this. They would even ghost you and go silent mode on you. Mm -hmm. This person will put you on red. This person will just say, it's like, well, I didn't receive any message. What do you mean? I, I just texted you right now and, and I heard, I didn't, I don't know. That's not my phone. Okay. You see the high priestess, they would ignore you for days and nights of no contact. For pentacles, no. Once you try to get to the bottom of the situation with the ace of swords, they shut down, high priestess. And then they become mysterious and you don't know what they're doing. Mm -hmm. And look at that. Five of wands. Okay. You cannot, you know, fry this person in, in their own oil. Okay. I don't know. Am I cooking today? Okay. Fry in their own oil. Mm. 
five ones with a justice card, you can't use their words against them because they're always just gonna say it's like, listen, that's your side of the truth and I got side of my truth. But what is the truth? That is the question. Link down there in the description box below. We shall continue this reading together with Sidereal Astrology so we will know more further on what is wrong with this person and why are you still dating them? I'll see you guys again. Bye!